Good afternoon, folks. Welcome back to the channel. It's October 15, 2023. Just giving an update on the video. Coming close to coming close to a dormant season now. And seeing how the grass has slowed down its growth. Last mow I gave was a uh, Wednesday, and not much has grown since I've done it. But I'm gonna give it a a trim today. I've raised the height of cut to three quarters of an inch. I'm trying to keep it a little taller for, uh, for the winter time. But uh, temperatures have been last night. I think it was like 56 or so, 54. And tonight it's actually going to go to 46. So it's going to actually be pretty cold. But as crazy as it sounds, I'm still trying to get some green up on the lawn. I'm wanting to green it up even more. So um, I, had, I want to do a little experiment. I went to uh, my local Walmart and I bought some blue def diesel exhaust fluid. I don't know if you guys heard about it, but it's essentially 30 something percent urea nitrogen, which is basically the same that pushes the growth. Thirty-two and a half percent urea. Doing uh, some research on YouTube, uh, you can apply this at I think ten ounce per thousand square feet, and I'll get you or nine and a half ounce per thousand square feet will get you at point one pounds of nitrogen, or you can increase it to fourteen and a half to nineteen and a half to get point uh, one five to point two pounds of nitrogen. So what I plan on doing is doing a 0.1 pounds per nitrogen, uh, 0 0.1, ni 0 0.1 pound of nitrogen per thousand square foot, and then I'm gonna mix that with feature. But this has to be watered in when you put it in. So my what I'm gonna probably do is use my backpack sprayer and use the flood jet, uh, T jet flood nozzle, to water uh, to put it in and then water it in. Then once the lawn dries, I'll come back in with the foliar tip, put this in. I just really want to see like if it's going to work or not because I haven't had much success with feature and it may be attributed to not having enough uh, nitrogen in the lawn but you know it's almost dormant season and it's crazy that I'm still trying to get the lawn to turn green who knows that I haven't been the lawn hasn't really been able to recover from the uh, herbicide sprays I've been doing on Celsius and certainty still have a little the, the yellow spots in the lawn they haven't grown back because uh there's not enough heat in the weather to push growth in the grass so uh maybe that kick of urea will help it out a little bit but yeah it's uh getting close to dormant season and just gotta pick up some of these uh little acorns these acorns have been falling down all over the place now it's a bit annoying i don't want this to ruin my reel more get that there well yeah overall i've checked the forecast uh this upcoming week it's actually going to warm back up to uh, 84 degrees as the high. And then uh, I think in the evenings, the temperatures are going to drop to like 60s, which is uh, still still pretty decent for some growth in the Bermuda grass. So that's why I'm going to try to push some green in. And what, what I'm going to do is I'm actually only going to mix uh, 500 square feet of product. I'm going to do a little test here in this area. I'm going to spray this area of the lawn with the uh, blue death and the, uh, the feature but first I need to get the uh, the mow going and after that if I if time permits then I'll be able to try to green up that section and see if it'll work and then next month I'm gonna do my last I guess it, they call it winterizer not fertilizer winterizer Basically, I'm going to close out with my, uh, I bought the uh, winterizer pack from Yard Mastery Stress Blend 7020. 
18 pounds that covers 6,000 square feet. And then you also apply aerate and humic max with it. And it also give you this uh, water, uh, the sprayer, hose in sprayer uh, with it. This won't be enough to cover my lawn, so uh, what it stated is that the cover is 2,000 square feet, so I'll have to do this three times if I want to get down to 6,000 square feet coverage. So I'm just going to put these in the backpack sprayer and then use the, uh, the TJ flood nozzle, nozzle and then water that in. I may, I may pick a day sometime in November where I see rain in the forecast so that it may uh, make it easier for all this stuff to get watered in. But if not, then I'll I'll hand water it in with the hose. But just a sneak peek to show you guys, uh, you know what my last application is going to be for November. And um, yeah, for October, a few more days. It's supposed to be my second application of Turfplex and Nutrizol, but I'm gonna forego that and I'm gonna go I'm gonna go ahead and try this this uh, diesel exhaust flow with feature. But uh, let's get the mowing first, and then we'll go from there.
already done. As you can see, uh, it's not very many grass clippings for the whole lot. It's about four inch all there is. So it shows that the growth hasn't really been taken off uh, with the weather. So, yeah, probably only need to cut like once a week now. All right, time for powder, power order scissor time. Time to get that on the video. Let's go.
boat. Took a little boat longer because I'm uh, trying to do some cinematic footage while I'm doing my boat. But anything to keep you guys entertained. Hope you guys like my channel. Like and subscribe. And stay tuned for some more videos. I'm going to try to improve on them and make them more entertaining for the viewers. But, yep. I don't know when I'll mow again. Maybe a week. Because it's showing you the clippings. Not very much has came off. And I'm mowing at uh, three quarters of an inch. So definitely uh, kind of see dormancy starting to happen. But uh, tonight's going to be around 46 degrees. So I'm going to, I might have to hold off on putting the uh, blue duff on the lawn. Because I need some heat and sunlight. And not too sure how that's going to turn out if I put that in tonight with the uh, the feature so I think I'll wait until maybe Monday uh, evening which will be tomorrow today's Sunday maybe I'll put that on and then uh, see if we'll green it up it should happen within a day or so so I wouldn't anticipate uh, having to wait to see any results please like and subscribe and stay tuned for more content in the next video Thanks.